healing the mind, healing the spirit is the most important because everything else, the body, will follow. My technique is using the body to heal the mind so the mind can heal the body. Smiling will cause happiness to start to occur on a, on a chemical level. All our memories, all our emotions, they are uh, cemented in our brain through smell. Michaels has been a physical therapist back back when he lived in Greece, as well as worked through many different facets of physical touch, and now is a massage therapist. And being in working with people on a physical level, he's noticed that the physical touch is a way to have spiritual healing. So they've done many different studies where they find that your physiology affects your emotional or mental state and vice versa. Mm -hmm. So that literally people can fake smile and they will actually start to produce more serotonin and dopamine like in in so you just lock around like this mm -hmm. before you know it you you know because there's this cross wiring that goes on chicken before the egg the egg before the chicken your mm -hmm. body can invoke and shift your mind and your mind can shift your body right mm -hmm. um you might notice that if you if I, you if i was to describe like a a depressed person you could already tell me what their body posture is, yeah, right? Like, it's probably sludged over, right? Exactly. And and the lower, are they looking down? They're probably not looking up. Their shoulders are probably curved. You can give me an image because you've recognized that, right? Just like if you if I gave you and said, think of a confident person, what are you going to think of? Oh, somebody it's up standing and standing tall. Yeah, and because you've experienced this so many times, right? And so that's the power of, you know, and say, okay, well, don't I need to change this first to change that? You say, no, well, if you change the physical, like literally just sitting more straight up makes you more alert. Yeah. Um, smiling will cause happiness to start to occur on a, on a chemical level. And not that, just that. Smiling is the most important, uh, yeah, the most important expression of a human being. Why? When you see somebody smiling, you hey, I'm smiling. <laughs> I'm smiling too. This is the way to spread the, the love, spread happiness. Spread love, spread happiness. We need a lot yeah. more of that. Yeah, Definitely exactly. Definitely in this world. And uh, basically, this is a landslide. When you we go a little bit to the rabbit hole, to the other rabbit hole right now. <laughs> it's very important for everybody when you wake up to have happy thoughts. There are three questions. I don't remember the three, but I remember the first question. What I am that you ask every morning that you, you wake up for a happy life? What I'm longing this day for what I'm looking forward in this day mm -hmm. to happen. That makes you excited that you woke up and it brings you to a, a better day. You enjoying this so far? Did you forget to subscribe? Make sure to do so. It takes two seconds. Just press that little button, the red one. You know the one. Just press it, little like. All right, enjoy the rest of this content. Gratitude. Yeah, gratitude as well. Uh, whenever you invoke what are you happy in your life for, it immediately lifts you up. Mm -hmm. Immediately you feel, because you remember, everything is memories. Yeah. And also aromatherapy, because all our memories, all our emotions, they... Uh, from what I learned, they are uh, cemented in our brain through smell. Okay. Uh, and it's a it's a holistic, let's say, approach to to that sentiment that people have. What sentiment? I I didn't use the right word. I get what you're Darn. saying, though, but so, like, basically, mm -hmm. you're looking at, you know, we have these 
five basic basic senses, and then in the mm-hmm. spiritual realm, there's that sixth sense that a lot of people talk mm-hmm. about. So you're you're combining four different of the senses that you can. I mean, people are blindfolded, so they can't really have their sight, you know. Um, but you know, or they're face down, or whatever the case may be. But if you're taking away that, you're 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 having sound, mm-hmm. you're having smell. You have a physical touch, and then you're grabbing into the ether, that sixth sense, and and, and manipulating the energy and, as well. And you said that they have their eyes covered. Mm-hmm. When you have your eyes covered, it doesn't stop to, to, to see. Yeah, you just see with your mind's eye. Exactly. So you have sight. You indulge the, the sight uh, uh, viewing because when you have aromatherapy, in the room, like uh, the aroma, uh, they remind you subconsciously of happy or uh, uh, happy memories. It brings you happy memories, mm-hmm. which you see with your mind's eye. <laughs> so, yeah. so you're kind of creating this immersive experience where mm-hmm. you're taking instead of getting like to use your words instead of like giving a healing that would maybe affect the person 25% and they'd walk out and they'd feel better and they'd have um, a, a lot of benefits from it but you're taking that a few steps further and you're saying okay well besides that mm-hmm. let's bring in an energy healer mm-hmm. besides that let's allow for the binaural beats to slow down their overactive mind to put them back mm-hmm. into a mental balance so almost like they're doing a meditation in a way but it's just reconnecting and realigning and then you're bringing in smells that are activating emotions that are causing memories of bliss or joy or or whatever else or even just the different essential oils that you might use that invoke that if you like this content make sure that you like subscribe and comment below and we also have amazing link right there for some cool product. I know you want to check it out. I know you want to click it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Come on. You can do it. All right. Until next time. Have a beautiful, blessed day.